Hi, I'm Nora Fleming Lee, the CEO of Coastal Heritage Society. We've been keeping a pretty big secret, and it's time to let you in on what we've been working on. First, some background. This building at Georgia State Railroad Museum was the storehouse for the Central of Georgia Railway. It was built in 1925 and has been used for various purposes over the years. In recent decades, primarily as storage. And now this space is being reimagined once again. By the end of this year, this 11,000 square foot structure will become part of the neighboring Savannah Children's Museum and will be the museum's first indoor space. Let me say that again. Savannah is getting an indoor children's museum right here in the historic district. Let's go check it out. Welcome to the future home of the STEAM Center at Savannah Children's Museum. An immersive experience called Numbers in Nature will be our first exhibit occupying the entire building. Patterns surround us in nature. Patterns also inspire us as we create or build things. Our key to unlocking these patterns is math. In Numbers in Nature, guests will explore an interactive gallery where you'll uncover the patterns in your own body and in centuries of music, art, and architecture. Step inside the mirror maze, a massive mathematical pattern, a dizzying, seemingly infinite sea of triangles to navigate and find the secrets inside, including the way out. It's an attraction that will engage the whole family and keep you coming back time after time because there's so much to discover and explore. This 100-year-old historic industrial building needed extensive preservation and upgrades to get it ready to welcome guests into a new educational space. The bathrooms have been expanded and completely remodeled. The new dedicated classroom space was created. We have a new roof where we successfully retained much of the original tongue and groove decking and replaced what was beyond salvage. Don't worry, we retained all the character, charm, and quirks of this old building. It's been a years long process and we couldn't have done it alone. Coastal Heritage Society is so grateful to the city of Savannah for their partnership to bring this national historic landmark that they own back to life. Thank you, Colonial Group Incorporated, the Lesher Family Foundation, and our other donors for their vision and generous support to help us get this project off the ground. The future is really bright, and we can't wait to show you how the STEAM Center at Savannah Children's Museum will come to life. 